Hello y'all, this is the Roblox game, generic zombie game, and this you select a kit and engage in battle against an endless wave of zombies. And we're in some kind of lobby area currently, we have a zombie dictionary over here, and it says zombie, normal zombie, normal stats, no abilities, there's a tank, the Kaboomer, Joe, Max, Colin, Fred, David, Ethan, and there are mini bosses and bosses in general. There's a boss wave every 15 minutes, I think, and we have a shop here. And these are the different kits. We start off with soldier, and it says recommended for beginners, average in all fields, uses shotgun, recommended for close range, has grenades. And there's other classes such as medic, tomato, alchemist, tank, motorist, and rogue. And besides that, we have some kind of buy money NPC. Then we have something about inviting our friends. And we have this prestige master here. You can prestige your levels and you can buy levels with money you earn, I think. So you can reset your character in game to come back to the lobby. So let's go into the game. So wave one is on its way. And I guess it's like a classic style Roblox game. That's the aesthetic it's going for maybe. And we have this grenade here. Go off, please. Can it go off? Can I throw it? I don't know how it works. It's just like, it has a percentage. Will it go off? Go off. Please. Whatever. It went off slightly. Did we hit something? Oh no. That's not enough. There's zombies. Lots of zombies. That's a Kaboomer. There are variants. Oh no. Use, just use the shotgun. Spam the shotgun and run, run, run around with the shotgun. That's all I got here. Kaboomer, get out of here. Get out of here. There we go. Fantastic. So, grenade is way... Oh, you can drop it after... It has cooldown, that's interesting. So wave two is gonna begin now. So there is boss waves, not every 15 minutes. I may have accidentally said that. It's every 15 waves, I think. Let's see how far we're gonna get here. There's kaboomers and tanks. Be careful though. Throw this grenade down now. Please be useful, I missed horribly. And just focus on this basic zombie here. Take out this tank and that tank. And this zombie, I don't know how many waves total there are, but there's at least 15. And take care of this tank here, fantastic. There we go, wave three will happen soon, and we'll see how we can handle that in a moment. We have our grenade and our shotgun with us, and we have like 15 cash at this point. So we should be fine, hopefully throw a grenade now. Or a grenade, it didn't really go too far. Whoops. And the Kaboomer just goes down without issue at all. Fortunately, these zombies, they're not very fast, so as long as I don't get surrounded, we should be good. And throw a grenade now. Go off, please. Good. Fantastic. That was a big boom for us. That's what we needed. Wonderful. That's what I need to advance forward to wave four. And there we go. So we have our shotgun with us, and it's just doing loads and loads of damage. And this kit we have, the soldier, is pretty good, honestly. We just gotta be careful and not get swarmed since we are alone, really. So there's a basic zombie, get all of them. Good, good, Kaboomer's gone. And this is a very easy wave, honestly, in general. And the mass, the, well, the higher ones must be just absurd. Just extremely absurd and filled with tons and tons of things wanting to destroy you. And now we have wave five in a few seconds. Can we handle it? Well, I think we can handle it. We just gotta be careful though. And now here come these guys here. Okay, Kaboomer goes down. They're very weak. And so are these tanks, sort of. Basic zombie. Oh, there's Max. That's a very interesting zombie design, not gonna lie. I think he's a mini boss. Oh no, he can run and jump. He goes down relatively easy though. So it's all fine, it's good, it's good. We're alive, we survive for now. And now we have wave six on its way. I wonder if we can make it to wave 15. I'm not entirely sure if we'll get that far though. Not sure at all, I'd like to, but maybe we could, maybe we can't. And I wonder if Max is just going to be part of the waves in general now. I guess not. Just keep defeating these guys here, and we should be fine. And what is this, Colin? That's a tiny little zombie. 
I guess we're gonna have a mini boss. A mini boss will be in every single wave. And your health does regenerate gradually if you're not taking any damage of any kind. And it's very interesting that there is named zombies. Like there is like tanks and kaboomers and you have Colin and Max. Just interesting naming scheme there. Now we have wave seven on its way and we should be able to handle this shotgun is really carrying us through. Pretty good weapon, honestly, for a starting weapon. And come on, give us wave seven. Here we go. Here's Colin. Take him out. He's sort of tanky. He's like a tank, but he's tiny. Throw a grenade. Grenade misses horribly. Oh well, how's the grenade cool down still? Oh no, there's Max. There's the one that rushes people. He can charge at you. And be careful here. These ones are gonna go down soon. So I guess we're now going to be facing two mini-bosses every wave, it looks like. And that is going to be very much a challenge for us, because those mini-bosses, they're either very small and tanky, or very fast and big. So we'll see now what happens in wave 8, which will begin in a few seconds. And I hope we can stay alive. Come on, take out these zombies here, turn around, mini-boss anywhere. There's no mini boss here? Okay, that's pretty nice. No mini bosses at all. Throw a grenade in a moment once it cools down. Cooldown takes forever though. Throw a shotgun out, throw a grenade. Fantastic. And take care of these zombies here. Dun, dun, dun. I'm gonna start getting swarmed very soon. More so than I already am. So, that will be fun. And now wave nine is upon us. Okay then. And we have a few seconds to wait, get our grenade ready. Do I want to throw it out in advance? Possibly. Throw it now, go. Boom, it did some damage. Oh, that's fantastic. I think we took out Max. Oh no, there's two of them. There's two Maxes. Man, those guys are terrifying. They rush so quickly. Watch out for him. Hit him in the background. Yeah, there we go. He's gone. Thank goodness. What is that one? It's another boss. Another mini boss, I think. He shoots fireballs. He said, that's Joe. Joe's gonna light people on fire. Okay, he shoots beams of flames. Noted. Very much noted. Fortunately, I don't think he fires them straight, though, so that's good for us. Well, he may not fire them in our direction, at the very least. I gotta heal up. So let me just sort of heal here. Come on. Take care of that zombie. Good. Now we have wave 10 on its way. Can we make it to wave 15? I don't know. We're doing good so far. As long as we don't encounter too many Joes, we should be fine. The average Joe just burns us with so much blazing wrath in that special attack they have. Oh no, there's another Joe. Throw a grenade. And that doesn't do enough. Focus on him. Focus on him. Don't get caught. Just keep moving. Keep moving. No, no, he's hitting me. He's hitting me. There's two of them. There's two of them. Oh no, throw a grenade. Throw a grenade. And the grenade goes off. Get Joe. Good, we got Joe. And just focus on this horde here. And I may just intentionally run, a, run around just so I can heal a little bit. A little bit. I'd love to have more HP. It would be fantastic for me, really. Yes. So you... I need to heal, so I'm going to keep running around briefly. And this will take a moment here. And we're just going to go in circles. This is to strat the heal fast without having to fight more waves of zombies too quickly, I think. And we need to get back to our max HP, ideally. And we'll stop around. We'll take out this tank once we get to 100 HP. Because then I think we can get enough regeneration done during the wave intermission. And take them out now. There we go. So wave 11 will be here in, in what? 11 seconds, 10 seconds, nine, okay. Please no Joes, no Joes, no Joe, please, no Joe. Joe is overpowered, he does a lot of damage. Any Joe, any Joe, any Joe, any Joe. No Joe, okay, good, throw that grenade down. Okay, wait, never mind. there's a Joe. And there's a Max, Max and Joe. Max is easy, Joe is not. Joe likes using flames. Fire at him from a distance. The others don't matter. He matters the most. Fortunately, the shotgun is very good. Very good weapon, the shotgun is. And focus on these guys here. Throw a grenade. Big boom. Just knocks a few of them away. 
Did a little bit of damage. And as long as we can take out Joe from a distance, we'll be just grand. And keep fighting here. Good. Now we're on wave 12. If I can focus on taking out those special mini bosses from a distance, we'll be good. But if I can't get them, that may be bad for us. So wave 12 in a few seconds now. We've taken no damage in wave 11. And who's coming? Who's here? Oh, just Max? Okay, that's going to be easy. I think it's just him anyway. Yeah, just him. This is going to be simple. Take him out. There we go. Once you get the mini bosses, these, these waves are very easy. And just keep running around. We're at like a 256 cash by now. And take these guys out here. They can't do anything. They just move too slowly. That's their big problem. They can't move fast enough. That's their big issue. There we go. And now we go on to wave 13. And I want to see, I want to see those big bosses soon enough. I think they'll be here in wave. Oh, there's somebody. There's someone new named Joe. There's a Joe going to be fighting Joe. Joel is going to be fighting Joe. And we should be fine. Hopefully, as long as he doesn't get lit on fire. He's good. I think he's good anyway. So just keep taking those guys out. Watch out. Watch out. Help him out from a distance. Take out the one that keeps shooting flames. Help him out. Help him out. Help him out. He's fine. I'm still going to chase myself. He's going to get lit on fire, isn't he? Oh, there's Colin. Hi, Colin. Very small, very fast, very deadly. And Joe... Joel was able to defeat Joe. And now we'll go on to... Wave... what? Wave 14. And I may stop at Wave 15. I just want to see if there's a boss wave. Or anything like that. And let's see what happens here. As Wave 14 will be upon us soon. At least we have help. We have help from Joel here. He was pretty good. And that's a nice little jump animation we have. I think it just sort of sprints us forward quite a bit. And he was able to take him out fast. Wow. Throw a grenade. And grenade will go off. And there's not many not many zombies here at all in this one. Pretty nice jump in this game, honestly, in the generic zombie game. And now we're going to be done with this wave very soon. There we go. Fantastic. And here we have wave 15. And will this be a boss wave? Maybe it will be. Maybe it will. I hope it is. If not, I, I'm just going to stop after wave 15. I want to see a boss. Please, give me a boss game. Give me a boss. Anything. Anything. Uh, whatever, we're fine. We should be fine. There's tons of these guys, though. And after we make it through this, we're good. And come on, survive. Oh, there's the boss. I see him now. He's massive. Wow. That guy's big. Get Joel. I mean, Joe, not Joel. Joel's my teammate. What is that guy's name? His name is what? What is his name? And he spawns little fighters. They're called poppers. Okay. So what's he called? The. Da oh, it's David. Okay. David. David's big and he spawns these things. So he just spawns them continuously until he dies. Those are interesting, aren't they? They have, like, very enlarged heads, and this guy's head is in his stomach. It looks like, or is... Yeah, so David's gonna go down, and we defeated this boss zombie, it looks like. And that's good, and wave 16 is coming soon, but I'm gonna end this video here. This has been the generic zombie game on Roblox. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe.